Hi, this is Mandy from Sunflowers and Doors. Welcome back to my channel. Um, so today is day seven um, of the hashtag JJII31 in 31, which is 31 days of tags for the 31 days of um, July 2023. So today, again, is another really, really simple concept. Um, all of these tags are really simple concepts. Um, and today is literally just a vellum um, tag. Really simple. Um, you can print directly onto the vellum if you like. Um, that is definitely doable. But um, <clears throat> I'm not going to do that today just purely because I have um, some tags already printed that I think will be um, ideal. So again I'm using the um, simple daisy kit and it literally is just a really simple kit with daisies all over the place, um, nice and fresh for spring. and. Yeah, it was a toss up between this and the French floral, but I've decided to go with the daisies just because I do love daisies. Um, yeah, I like them a lot. So all I've got here is the daisy tag for the kit. It's not on particularly thick paper um, because I was just, these are pieces I was just trialing for the kit. Um, but because they are going to be going in a journal, then I'm going to back those with some pretty solid card. This is a 300, um, 300 GSM card. So it is pretty, once it's on, it's on. Okay. So all of the information for the um, event is down below. There's a giveaway um, attached to the Facebook group and there is the giveaway attached to the YouTube channel um, and you have to do something for each of them um, but there is loads of information below so that you just need to pop on and have a little look and see what is what. Okay, so I am at the moment just going to finish trimming off some of these excess bits. Like so. And that is the basis for the tag really really simple now what i find i really struggle with acetate and glue um, i find that it goes better with um, two-sided tape but i find it buckles quite a lot with glue what i have found though is if instead of putting the acetate kind of on the tag so to speak, if you put the tag straight on the acetate, it does actually help a little bit because you get the chance to really work it in. Um, so it doesn't buckle quite as much. As I said, you can print directly to the acetate, uh, to the, not the acetate, I'm saying acetate, sorry, it's vellum. Um, you can print directly to the vellum, um, which I have done and I love the look of it. I really do love the look of it, but as I said, today just I had the card and I had the paper already um, to go. So that's what we're going to do with this. Scissors desperately need a clean. So I hope you're all well. Um, this will be going out, as I said, in um, this is going to be going up on the 
7th of July, gosh. I'm filming in advance and that feels like a lifetime away, but it won't be. It'll be here before we know it. So really, really simple vellum tag. What I'm going to do now, it hasn't buckled as much as it normally does, uh, which is great. I'm just going to sew around the edges and I'll be right back. So just a quick, simple stitch around the edges, just to give it some interest. I am going to pop these to one side, just so I grab my bits and pieces. No matter how organised you try to be, there's always something, isn't there? Always something. So I'm going to create a nice daisy eyelet for the top of this one. So pretty little eyelet at the top, I stitched on there, which was a bit silly, but it happens. And then I am going to just put um, a label on the front. On top, you can layer lots of different things on top if you want to. I'm just going to do the label. If I can. On there. And then I am going to simply put a little uh, charm. In fact, I might not use gel prints, I might use ball clips instead. Just everything going on the floor. So just a really simple little charm. Gold and cream colour. So it'll go lovely. And yeah, a really, really simple acetate um, bookmark. You can write on the back as a journaling spot. You can cover it with paper if you want to for a journaling spot. But really really simple what a couple of minutes of that um and again these are fantastic for mass mix uh just to get some even if you just get some pretty basic backings in um and then build on them on the front but yeah really simple tag hope you enjoyed it i will let you go there and i will be back tomorrow with day eight and um, we'll see what we come up with then. Until then, stay safe, as always, and I'll speak to you then. Bye.